Thing for Hurricane Helene and Milton on its way, a lot of help is needed in the southeast. As a Kansas group making its way back from Helene rescue efforts, another group is now back on their way to Florida to help with Milton. 12 News reporter Julia Daughtry explains. Julia? That's right, Mike. Members of Kansas Tax for one, Task Force 1 and 2 met up to switch out equipment needed for the hurricane, but one mission remains the same. They both want to help those who aren't in Kansas. Kansas first responders from multiple cities across the state came together to tackle one mission to help rescue as many people as they can in states thousands of miles away. That's why the Kansas Task Force 1 did as they traveled across the country to help those who were hit by Hurricane Helene. They were doing uh, search and rescue efforts in boats, uh, driving, you know, driving the boats around looking for um, through structures, looking for people who needed assistance. Uh, some of their efforts were also on foot. They checked one of their updates I got indicated they checked over 600 structures in one day. Aiding in two states in two weeks from dangerous floods to mudslides and helping multiple people who were trapped along the way. The 20 people on Task Force One are coming home, but with Hurricane Milton in the near future, another task force will be able to assist. As um, they were being deployed down and our other team was demo uh, demobilizing coming back, they were able to plan a rendezvous point. Pictured here, Task Force 1 and 2, leaving and preparing to lend a helping hand to people far away from home. So as an employee for the state, uh, Kansas State Fire Marshal, I'm extremely proud of that. As a citizen of the state of Kansas, I'm even more proud of that. And being able to do that is such a huge sacrifice for those individuals. I think it's something all Kansans should be very proud of. Tax Force 1 is set to be back this evening, and the date for Tax Force 2 is unknown at this time.